What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Another mosaic tips and tricks. We're gonna be testing two pads that assist you with cutting mosaic tiles on a manual tile cutter. First pad is this, made by Monolith. This pad runs about 75 bucks. Got a little channel in there for your Monolith snapper. This allows you to manual cut cleanly Mosaic tile. The second test is going to be a $10 mouse pad via Amazon. What we're gonna do with this is pretty simple. Trace out the dimensions of this monolith pad, cut it with some shears, and basically compare the two. See how well this performs as well as this performs, cleanly cutting mosaic tile with a manual tile cutter. We're gonna run these tests cutting with a monolith manual tile cutter and at the end of the video we're going to attempt to use these pads cutting mosaic with a cheap twenty dollar manual tile cutter all right let's cut some mosaic all right guys let's talk about the mosaics that we're going to run this test on we've got six of them here the first test will be three eighths inch hard porcelain tile this will be a good test to see if it can crack this nice and clean. Second test will be river rock. See how well it performs on your river rock mosaic. We'll also test some thin glass mosaic. We've got some sheeted ceramic mosaic here as well. We will also test, of course, some glass mosaic. And lastly, some penny mosaic. So let's get set up and Cut some mosaic. All right, let's duplicate this monolith pad with a $10 mouse pad. And there you go. Of course, the monolith pad is thicker than this, but We'll see how well this performs, as well as the monolith pad. Okay, let's start with the monolith pad here. You've got your channel. First test, thick porcelain sheeted mosaic. Here we go. Very nice. Look how clean it manual cut this porcelain sheeted mosaic. Super clean. All right, let's try the Amazon mouse pad. Would you look at that guys again a super clean cut with the ten dollar amazon mouse pad let's move on all right guys let's try some river rock mosaic this is going to be a little tricky we'll give it a shot first on the monolith And there you go. Does not cut River Rock very well and that's not surprising. Typically you wouldn't want to 
cut river rock this way, but hey, I wanted to give it a shot. So monolith doesn't cut it this well. I'm just gonna skip the Amazon mouse pad. So let's move on here. All right, next up, we'll try some glass mosaic here. First with the monolith, second with the mouse pad. Not a problem at all. Very, very clean cut. So let's pull this monolith pad off and check the Amazon mouse pad. And there you go, still a clean cut. I didn't get as lucky as the monolith with these lines here, but it cut it, this glass, with no problems. Now we'll try some sheeted ceramic on the monolith. As expected, Cut it, no problems. Let's move on to the mouse pad. And again, as expected, cut this, no problems. Let's move on to the penny mosaic. Here we go, ceramic sheeted penny mosaic on the monolith. Well, there you go. I cut it okay. That spine in the monolith pad helps. Let's see how well the mouse pad does. Well, as expected, the mouse pad struggled a bit. Penny mosaic, this especially is just a little too small for the mouse pad. It doesn't have that spine like the monolith does. Now we'll cut some thin glass mosaic. Start with the monolith. Yeah, it looked like the monolith struggled on this as well. I think the smaller the mosaic, I mean, this is very small, maybe half inch or less by half inch. So I'm not gonna even attempt to cut this with the mouse pad. If the monolith can't do it, the mouse pad can't do it. So lastly, we'll try the cheap $20 manual tile cutter with the monolith pad as well as the mouse pad. We will cut the glass mosaic as well as the ceramic mosaic. Here's the glass. Well, there you go, not bad for a $20 manual tile cutter with the monolith pad. Let's check out the $20 manual tile cutter with the $10 mouse pad.
And there you go, a $20 manual towel cutter and a $10 Amazon mouse pad. Fairly clean cut. Let's try the ceramic. Cuts very clean. Move on to the mouse pad. And again, very clean for the ceramic on the mouse pad as well. I'm sorry, Monolith, we still love your products. We obviously use them on a regular basis, remodeling bath and showers, but I needed to give the people what they wanted and that's a cheap alternative, $10 mouse pad. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. As usual, please subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. The night was born to fight Mythical, so mystical, think what you like